Well, Dave Chappelle is the latest comedian to suffer in a shocking onstage attack while he was performing stand up last night at the Hollywood Bowl. The show was disrupted by a man rushing the stage with a weapon and tackling Chappelle. Radio personality L'Oreal from the Morning Hustle joins us now with the latest. L'Oreal, good morning. What a wild story. Good morning. Wild is not even the word. Mm. It was crazy. As soon as I woke up, I saw this everywhere this morning. Let's just say this man thought he was going to be able to tackle Dave Chappelle and just walk off gracefully, and that's not what happened. Dave Chappelle did fall down, but then when they got backstage, it seems as though Jamie Foxx and a bunch of other securities from this venue and other friends ended up jumping on the guy. I'm talking about literally stomping the man out to the point where he was carried away on a stretcher. Now, on that stretcher, you could see his arm was pretty much like it seemed as though it was taken off and put back on backwards like oh. a Barbie doll or a G.I. Joe. <laughs> so, Yikes. All of this was being filmed for the Netflix is a joke festival and it's going down all the way from April 28th to May 8th and also Chris Rock was in attendance. He was another person that was performing and he got on stage and asked was that Will Smith? <laughs> right. I was going to say there's a little sense of irony there or not. The fact that, that Chris Rock was there for that moment. I mean, but you know, you go back to, OK, so the guy that rushed the stage was injured. Thank goodness Dave Chappelle yes. was not. And he went on with the show. He went on with the show and then he made jokes of, of course, a trans joke and some people didn't appreciate that. But they do know who this man is. His name is Isaiah Lee. He's 23 years old. He's currently being held on $30,000 bail and he got charged with a felony count assault with a deadly weapon. Now, the weapon that he had was said to be not a real semi-automatic gun, but it did have a knife that actually released from the gun, and uh, that was what was threatening. So, allegedly, Jamie Foxx seen this man point the gun towards Dave Chappelle, and that's what made him jump in and decide that they had to, you know, deal with this man right. in, in the right way, I guess. Well, I mean, thank goodness they did. Um, but at the same time, I mean, in the wake of what, of course, what we saw happen at the Oscars and in the wake right. of this now, I mean, I would imagine it's tough to be in stand-up comedy right now. You've got to be concerned that people are going to just take things too far. Very tough. And hopefully they look at this video of this man's arm and say, no, maybe I should not do that. Because if you remember, Mike Tyson uh, had a similar situation at a comedy club just the other day where the man had a gun as well. And Mike Tyson ended up giving him a hug. They let the man go and the man never got arrested. But in this case, you know, this guy has to pay for his consequences. Absolutely. Well, L'Oreal, thank you for the update on this story. We appreciate it. Thank you so much. Please don't jump on any stages. Right, please don't. <laughs> please don't. And you can listen to L'Oreal on the Morning Hustle weekdays from 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. on Hot 107.9.